Hi, this is Electra Avellan and Elisa Avellan and, and you're watching the Down the Road Show with JC and KC. Down the Road Show is a creative venture of Murdoch Worldwide Entertainment. You're listening to the Down the Road Show with JC and KC. You're watching the Down the Road Show with JC. And I'm KC. And we are speaking with Electra and Elise. We are here at Wizard World in Anaheim. And why are we talking to them? Because they were in Machete. That's right. Great film. <laughs> and Grindhouse, yes. And Grindhouse. Oh, Grindhouse, and too. <laughs> and others, others. But let's, let's talk about Machete. How'd you guys get hooked up with that project? It was uh, the great opportunity to work with Robert and Quentin again. Uh, Robert called us in. He wanted to bring the, the same babysitter um, kind of feel that was really funny in Planet Terror. And I think that, it, you know, he was really excited to bring that energetic, comedic timing again. So he called us in. Slash the half-naked <laughs> twin part of it. <laughs> that doesn't Which hurt. Which is now not babysitting, but nursing <laughs> machete. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why we're in it. As proven in the movie. Now, are there any upcoming projects that you're working with Robert with again? Or are you allowed to talk about those? Can't talk about it. Oh, okay. Yes. Soon, right. soon, very soon, we'll be able to share with you. And, and it's another dual project that you'll both be in? Okay. We are working on a project together, but we can't talk, we can't about, talk about anything. Oh, Not right now. Wow. Yes. Okay. Now, you do do projects separate from each other now and then, right? Yes, you, yes. You, you, yes. So, all, all yeah. of you directors out there, you can book them individually. Yes, you yes. can. Yes. Actually, yes. Please do so. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We are individual people. Work is good. <laughs> yes, we I like just it. did a movie called um, Amelia's 25th, and it's a romantic comedy, and it's great. I hope you guys like it. It comes out maybe spring next year. So. Can you at least get me upcoming projects? I don't have any alone upcoming projects right now that I'm doing by myself. No, I'm not. But um, <laughs> she well, has a few. lines are open. Mm -hmm. Yes, lines are open. <laughs> so right. which of those two movies did you guys like the outcome better? Machete. Yes, I, I, I love I Machete. So. Really enjoyed I think that it, was, it was a lot more. It was a lot more. Uh, I thought it was funnier. Not, not that just the movie was funnier, just the way that it was released. I guess. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe it was the hype. The hype because it was another Grindhouse movie. Also, I love movie. working with Danny. Danny. Is, Danny is a freaking riot. Yeah. yeah. This amazing. guy is just. Give us some good stories. Okay. Oh, this one. This is the best story. No, no. The story how we met him. Is the best story. Yeah, but this story is really fucking okay, great. Tell What's us both. Story? What is okay, story? so this story is really funny. We were shooting the scene and we run out and we start shooting and we run out of bullets and and Danny's like, cut the scene, please cut the scene. I need to talk to the girls. So he runs up to Robert and he's like, can I talk to the girls? And Robert is like, sure. So go talk to the girls. Fuck Danny, you always do this. So he runs up to us and he's like, girls, this is it. This is your moment. You have a very short seen in this movie so you have to milk the shot this is the Denny Trail school of milking so, <laughs> not joking no I swear this is what he said this is what he said nice so he goes like just shoot and make a big face and scream and then shoot and pretend like you're shooting and shoot and pretend like you're shooting and, and then we did it if there's no more bullets in the gun you pretend you you're shooting you keep going and look like a badass and, and like, you you're milk. like you're hurting but it's okay yeah, he's like you milk that <laughs> shot and then he goes he goes <laughs> If you did it, if you do it really well, it will make it in the post in the poster, and it did, and it did. as you can see, and it make made it into the international poster as well. But nice. well, you made it. I made it. I don't know where I am oh, in that no. poster. Behind hey, the fire, whatever, whatever. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, you, that's you're okay. twins. Feel free to lie and say that you. Yes, yes. sometimes I do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was me. We just flipped the negative around. And, that was me, right? Yeah. That's me. What, that's her. You, you, okay. said you, had a, you said you had a good story of how you guys met him. Okay, so, yes. So we've known about Danny Trejo for years. My father was really good friends with him when they were shooting from Dust Till Dawn and Desperado. Desperado. So he was like, you know, this humble man, he's Mexican, someday you'll meet him, he's amazing, blah, blah, blah. But we were really scared of him from the movies. Oh, he looks scary. He's I mean, very intimidating, isn't he? has a scary yeah. face. But my yeah. dad always said amazing things about him. So anyway, so we're look, totally looking forward to him, and we knew that he was in Brighthouse, but we've never really run into him during this shooting, and now we are flying to San Jose, for the WWE SmackDown. Oh, SmackDown! To That's promote right. Grindhouse. To promote Grindhouse. And this yeah. was before the movie release. And so we are flying, and in the airport, in we the, see in the gate, we see Danny we walking. Did walking, walking by, and we just run up to him. We're just like, oh my god, oh my god, Danny! And, he, and we just like, literally, just like, we tower over him with our high heels, and he is so short compared to us. And so we're like, oh my god, we're like literally we putting our boobs on his face. We're like kissing him, and he's like. Who like, are oh, you guys? Are you Am guys? I dying? We're like, we're walking daughters. And he was like, oh, oh, oh shit. You're in the family. 
Yeah. <laughs> he thought we were like fans. Hands up. Yeah, yeah we were like freaking out. We are fans, but he had no idea. So he was like, oh, I can hit on you guys, okay? <laughs> so he walked away. But it was kind of funny. It was really He's beautiful. I love him. Amazing story. I love Danny. So, so he was both intimidated and shy around you guys. Yes. So he, he pretty much had to give you guys the part. He That's takes right. care of us. When he's around us, he's just like, come here, mijita, come here. Yeah. And he just takes care of us. He's like our, our second father. Yeah, I've heard nothing but good things. That he's, he's a I great do. guy in, re, in real life. And, you know, he's very, very, you know, personable and everything he like is. that. He is so, very personable. You know, he's a very nice guy. And well into charity events and things like incredible. that. Incredible. Yeah, incredible human being. I'm, I'm really, really proud to know him and, and have him in my life. Fantastic. Well, excellent. Well, thank you, ladies, for uh, time out. Why don't you guys look in the camera and give Danny a big shout out and tell him how much you love him? Danny, I love you with all of my heart. I hope to see you very soon, maybe this week while I'm here. I love you and kisses and hugs. Mwah. And Danny, Jason, uh, Casey, and I invite you to come on to the Down the Road show and meet us anytime you want to. That would be fantastic. Bring the ladies with you. Yes. Nice. We're halfway there. OG's Pizza and Brewing Company in Anaheim, California is just moments away from Disneyland and the Anaheim Convention Center. Their friendly staff is serving up fun for the whole family in a sports-oriented atmosphere with great food and delicious beers. Join them on your next trip and enjoy different happy hour specials seven days a week.